Hey, what's up, guys? Zay Clark's Lost. And Speed Freak. This is a guide for Meat is Murder! Look at this In the new Advanced oh. Warfare DLC, the uh, Exo Zombies DLC. This is the big main Easter egg in the second map, the infection map. Uh, very, very long, so strap in. It's gonna be a wild ride. Whee. First thing you have to do is you have to get this golden skillet. It's in the spawn. You're gonna need the Exo uh, skeleton for it, so I would just come back to it on like round three or whenever you get the Exo suit. Yeah, the Exo suit can be found in the sewers, so don't worry about that. Yeah, basically. Uh, and once you have the golden skillet, now you're gonna have to open the secret room. So to open the secret room, you need to find these four valves that are randomly placed throughout the sewers, the two sections of sewers. Uh, they'll randomly spawn, and only one will spawn at a time. So after you actually press uh, X near them, and like make them start spewing stuff out, that's when the next one will spawn. So yeah. you can't get all four at the time. Those These wheels are a pain can be, to find. Yeah, they could be on the ground, they could be on the walls, they could be up on the ceiling. They are a pain. Once you yeah. do that, you want to make sure to put the skillet right on that, uh, that little, what is that, little podium? Little altar thing? Yeah, little oh. altar. Little and podium. Then, and then the next step. And then you're gonna have to kill a bunch of zombies here, because you gotta fill that skillet with zombie blood. Uh, oh, so, no. just spend a few rounds down here just killing as many zombies as possible. I would definitely recommend getting the cauterizer out of the box and getting contact grenades. That will contact help Contact grenades lot. help so much. You'll know it's done when the podium lifts up and you can pick up the uh, skillet. Exactly. So, yeah, exactly. You'll just pick up the skillet, then you gotta run to Burger Town, put the skillet down, because we are making a burger. Yeah. So, first component of the burger, you need some meat. So, again, there are gonna be four pieces of meat that spawn around the map all randomly uh one has to s you have to pick one up to make the next one spawn yeah. uh they're in the four main areas that being burger town value voltage atlas command and the sewers um and you have to pick them up take them over to the skillet place them down and then the next one will spawn and you have to find all four of these place them down this one is in the sewers i believe again completely random you they kind so of glow much of this stuff yeah. i didn't well, no, you get the the ending of everything. Yeah. So then uh, you're gonna need to get the magnetron from the box and cook the meat. Uh, you 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 will hear a little ding, ding. when it's all done, um, and that's how you know that you're done with uh, getting the meat. Now you're gonna need a bun because what's a burger without a bun? You need to kill this specific type of zombie. One will spawn every round. It's this zombie right here, the one with the hat on. He looks, yeah. uh, you know, he's like an employee he works Burger of Burger Town, basically that got infected. Exactly. So he's and he's gonna drop there. It is little bun. Little bun. You'll pick it up, and now you just gotta go place it on the burger over back on the skillet. Now, don't immediately pick up the burger. I would wait until you have a crawler left, because then when you pick up the burger, you're going to become infected. And so you're going to just, just have to cleanse yourself the same way that you cleanse yourself on infection rounds. Just run over to the little decontamination zone, uh, press square or X, uh, whatever, and... Um, huh, you can't you, make that jump. <laughs> I can't. Uh, and it'll become cleansed. Now you got to feed it to Bubby for some reason. I don't know why he's an animatronic. <laughs> then he'll start saying that uh, he needs battery power. So you're going to have to come to Atlas Command, press X uh, on this little infographic thing, and you have to really, really quickly run over to uh, this little section over here where the battery now will spawn. Now that's timed, so after a few seconds it'll disappear, but yeah. you know, you can just go back to the infographic again, press X, and it'll reset. Yeah, so this next part, you're basically going to take the battery over to the charging station gas station, which the, that's how it is in the future, and basically stand near it and wait for it to get completely full. Once it gets full, the battery will stop charging and it'll turn completely red like that, and you can pick it up. However, zombies will attack the battery and toxic rounds will knock it out, so make sure that you stay by and uh, keep crawling. It only takes about 60 seconds, so if you have a crawler, that would be that would be ideal. Yeah, exactly. Uh, so w once you give uh, the the batteries to him, he'll give you a key to the big burger up there. Now you're gonna need the launch codes, the nuclear launch codes for some reason that you need. Make so sure so to touch that screen, by the way, once you get up in the burger, because that is an important step. If you just go up there, it won't happen. You have to touch the screen, it'll say access denied. Now you're gonna need to gain access. Now to do this, you need the hand of a zombie. So. You're gonna have to turn on the instigator trap, and when an alligator is eating a zombie, you have to kill the gator. And while you kill the gator, you have to kind of run over him while holding down uh, X. And when you do that, you will get the little zombie hand, as you can see in the bottom left. This will give you access to this little hand scanner in the spawn. It's right by the mystery box here. Uh, over in here, just hold X here. It'll give you now this red card. They're basically codes, but they're decrypted somehow. So now you have to go back into the burger, uh, and you have to hold the X here. They'll start decrypting the codes. It'll kick you out. Yeah, and now immediately. Randomly, bombs will start flying out of the burger. 
But they're not bombs. They're burgers. They're, they're burger bombs. They're, um, they're belly bombers. Little little disclaimer. They'll kill you. Yeah, they, they will murder you. So I would recommend just dodging them if possible. Yeah. Uh, you can pick them up and throw them and use them, but, you know, yeah. eh, teach their own, I guess. Now for the final step. Once everything calms down, you have to go back up, pick up the now green card, because uh, now you're in the country. Uh, s then it, there. you have to wait for them to kick you out of the burger. Then give the card back to Bubby. Now you get the achievement. And Bubby comes alive, and he starts killing zombies, and it's awesome. It is and why did we awesome. do any of that? I have no idea. Well, because we wanted to make sure Bobby could be our little friend and he could but kill he, people. He dies immediately. Well, no, actually, why did no. he eat the burger? When you get that achievement, at least in that instance, he could either a do what he did there, or b he'll just explode and give you three drops. But anyway, that's Mina's murder. Have fun, everybody.